Trim. Hello, welcome back to the Spider's Web. It's another road too, and we're going to Ratington. Yes, it's our Saturday afternoon jaunt to Ratington Hospital. We uh, start the shorts half an hour, and we're there till the three. Um, A little bit of fun and frolic this afternoon, I think. Mind you, we usually do on a Saturday. It is quite good fun. <laughs> um, <clears throat> right, before we start, I do apologise for not having anything posted this week. Uh, just had um, a bit of a pain in the neck week, or a few weeks. We're being busy having to run here there and everywhere so I've just I've not had enough chance to sit down and um, get any painting done or anything but that will change <coughs> as I say I do intend to start the uh, what you call it the vampire hunters game painting those uh, I was hoping to get them started a few weeks ago, but uh, as I said, just had, well, early on it was a mix of not feeling too good, the dizzy spells catching up with me again, uh, but uh, after that's been sorted out, we've just been incredibly busy running here, there and everywhere, and um, so next week we will be starting with a vengeance of uh, getting things up and running once more um, <coughs> and getting videos put up. Uh, going to Scotland in a few weeks for a fortnight so I'll have to get a lot of um, content sorted so that uh, while we're away you'll have something to watch. <coughs> um, and uh, there will be, there may probably be videos as well being put up, just ad hoc videos as we go along. Little, um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say vlogs, but uh, <coughs> you know, it's just going to be some little, little videos that I like to, might like to share um, as time goes well, while we're away. Sorry, I was just taking more notes of the junction because there was three things happening at once. <laughs> and I was hoping that uh, <coughs> we could get through it without, without either being hit with a digger or uh, hit with a bus. <laughs> oh, well. We avoided both, so that's on the matter. Yeah, so, um, yeah, we're going to try and get some regular painting videos put up while we're away and uh, as I say as well as uh, getting a few videos put up um, actually filmed of while we're away um, they won't be very long videos they're not going to be well edited they're just going to be um, put up um, and let you have a, a look at what we're up to or a little snippet of what we're up to while we're away <laughs> we're going to have some fun Hopefully, the first holiday uh, me and Ollie have had since we've been together. Um, we're going up with my dad, and it's the first holiday that I've had for well, since 2011. So I'm looking forward to it immensely. Um, <coughs> <coughs> now, um, we're on the subject. Anybody who watches these videos who isn't yet aware and are interested in Mythic Battles Pantheon they're doing another Kickstarter for the exact same game starting on the 5th of June so if you're interested and you missed it the first time round get on it it's well worth it you've seen the figures from the base sets painted um, <clears throat> a lot of people have mentioned how they missed it and how they regret missing it you've got another chance get on it well worth it. Even if it's just for the minis, it's worth it. <coughs> um, 
that's, well, as I say, that starts at 5th of June, so keep your eye open for that one. It's cheaper doing that than it is buying the thing off eBay, let's put it that way. <coughs> um, just thought I'd let you know about that one, if you didn't already know. <coughs> a load of sweat and tears, I hate it on this like this. The weather's changed, which affects the asthma. It's been lovely and hot over the last few weeks with the occasional um, bit of rain. But today, well, last night, the heavens opened. Today, it's a lot cooler, it's damp. <coughs> and it's, it affects my chest when it's like that, so that's why I'm a bit wheezy and uh, coughing quite a bit more than usual. Um, so, mm. nothing I can do about it, it's just the way it is. I've had my spray before I came out, so... <coughs> It's not seem to have taken effect. I say it's always like this when there's a sudden change in weather. Um, I've not slept. We did sleep very well last night. But thankfully, it's not as bad as it was last week. Where I went to bed, went to sleep on uh, Wednesday night. Um, woke up about 9 o'clock ish Thursday morning and then didn't sleep again until. Sunday night. Apart from having little cat naps during the night, it's been a case of waking up 20 minutes later on, or going to sleep 20 minutes later on the way for a few hours. It's, it wasn't a very pleasant few days for me. When the insomnia kicks in, <coughs> um, it wipes me out for a few days. But <coughs> yesterday I felt really good. For a change. No aches and pains. <coughs> so, no aches and pains and breathing okay. And <coughs> it felt as though I could, I had a bit of energy. So, we decided to take Laddie for a good walk through Bayol, which is a local. Um, it, <coughs> it used to be a, <coughs> a home uh, owned by the Lord. Balcaris, which is a local to Wigan. I don't know if anybody's heard of it. Um, it was then taken over by the council, who have now sold it over for a hotel. But with it comes a lot of woodland. Um, <coughs> you may have seen, I think I've put videos up of uh, Laddie running about in the woods, and that's part of they all. We went to another <coughs> um, another but went round a different way this time than we have done uh, previously in the videos. And he enjoyed it, he had a good swim uh, in, one of, in the, the little pool on the side of the, the canal. Um, he had a good mooch around the trees and that, and re he really enjoyed himself. Me and Ali really enjoyed ourselves. <coughs> I think it's today, my legs feel like lead. <laughs> <coughs> That's the problem with fibro. 
<laughs> when you feel okay one day, you do too much and you pay for it for the next three or four days. But, oh well, I'm just absolutely shattered today. I just feel like lead and I feel as though I've been hit by a bus. <laughs> but it was worth it for that yesterday afternoon, it was really lovely. And then we went up to Scraggers last night and we had a game of uh, level 7 escape rolls. What do you call it? Is it? I don't know, the second level 7 game. Ben has that one, so we had a... <coughs> <coughs> we had a game of that. I've never played it before. Ben struggled through the rules. Did a better job than I usually do when I try to struggle through the rules, because I find it very difficult reading and understanding rules. <coughs> Even if I have the rule book in front of me, I just struggle really, really badly with trying to make sense of how to do things. The words just don't seem to click with me. Um, so, uh, he, did, he did well, but we did have a little bit of a struggle through parts of it. Missed certain things out, but it's, it seems a really good game, so we hoping we're going to be able to get going with uh, the campaign. So we did suggest about uh, what you call it. Um, <coughs> <coughs> we did suggest about um, carrying on from the, uh, from the second mission. But I said well, we might as well start again. Use this as a bit of a, a playthrough. Um, and then, now we've got the kinks out of the way, we can always go back to it, try and play it properly. Um, and then carry on from there. Because <coughs> if you're going to play the campaign, I'd sooner start playing it properly. Um, and how we use the first mission as like a test run. We'll see what happens anyway, it's, it's not as if we're going to be doing it very soon, I don't think. <coughs> um, so hopefully, as well, um, a scraggle will be coming down on the 11th of June, and... Uh, <coughs> oh dear lord. And uh, we're having a game tonight then. Um, depending on who's coming down, I don't know what we're playing as yet, but if it's just the three of us, um, Mythic Battles Pantheon will be on the table. Uh, we would like to have a proper game of that. We've had one game, well, a couple of games already. Um, but it's been the learner game from the rule book, and then we just had to try it a basic skirmish game before playing skirmish game. It was, we really enjoyed it. <coughs> um, so I think that's that will probably hit the table. Possibly Vampire Hunters. Pop, uh, there's one he's brought got as well that he said he'd bring down if he can find it because he's put his away. Um, so there's choices. We're going to try and get it. Depending on who's coming down, we're going to try and get it. Oh, excuse me. Um, that um, one of these games will come down because they have invited my daughter and her boyfriend, so I don't know whether, I'm saying boyfriend, fiance, uh, I don't know whether they're coming on or not, they've not got back to me yet. <coughs> but if they don't come, it'll just be the three of us. If they do come, we'll play something completely different. We we'll probably won't have it on camera, but that's the unfortunate part. <coughs> Because the ones that my daughter will play uh, are things like um, what do you call it, um, Cards Against Humanity and things like that, which have no qualms about playing on camera, but if I'm going to play that on camera, I want to see everybody's face. <coughs> and uh, my daughter is camera shy, she won't have a photograph taken, she won't be willing to be filmed. So, 
um, it's not that's not going to happen. Um, but it'll be the simple games that my daughter will play because neither of them really are gamers. Uh, her fiance likes um, what do you call it? Likes games, but it's usually quiz games they play and that kind of thing. So yeah, we'll see what happens when uh, on the evening. But uh, there may be videos coming up, there may not be. But I'm here now, so I'm going to have to go. So that's it from me. Uh, for this video, hope you enjoyed it. It's only a 15 minute ramble, but uh, I'm gonna have to get in there and cause aggravation. So, until next time, as always, take care, God bless, and bye for now. <laughs>